Hi guys, welcome to another tutorial on my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use video template for making quick video with Filmora 11. Okay, so it is very easy. So here is the startup window of Filmora 11 and all you need to do is to select this option instant mode and now you need to select a video template that you want to create okay and they have different genre from for your family education slideshow cinematic and also upbeat business or stuff like that so what you need to do is to preview the template right here and then decide if you want to use this template or not for example, I can select this option, cinematic, and then I'm going to select this one, the travel slideshow. So I can click this play button to review the template. Okay, just click here. And we can select other template right here also. For example, this is family happy memory. We can also select this option. I think it's okay and if we are happy with one template we can click this button use this template to start making video okay just click here use this template and now it will download the video template to your computer and the next thing you want to do is to import your video and photo to this area okay you can just click here to import your media for example I can click this plus button just click here and these are some footage some example footage i shot with my gopro okay and just highlight all of them and then click open all right and now you have all the footage in this window and you can rearrange your footage if you want for example i want to move this one to the beginning it will be here and if i want to delete something for example i can delete this one i can just click this button to delete it okay and do not show this again delete the selected media yes that's easy right and the next thing you want to click this button auto create to create your first video okay just click this option to start using the template and it will take some time for the program to create your timeline okay 91 92 93 94 <laughs> I have no idea why I have to count the percentage 98 <laughs> okay and the video is now ready and we can play to see the auto creation of Fimura 11 okay Okay, so it is not bad, right? And because the software add many special effects and also it add text to my video also. And there are also some special transition effect in the video. By the way, they did not recognize that this is not a family photo slideshow. It's just a vlog of me going around at my apartment and also drink coffee and stuff like that. But by the way, it is very nice. And this is the timeline, okay, or the storyboard of the video. And here we have some effect control, music setting, and global setting. For example, at the effect control, you can select the effect, and then you can turn off and on all the effect. Okay, for example, you can just click this option after effects with title and transition. And you can also check this box if you don't want to see the effect. Okay, no effect. By the way, you want to check this one all the effect this is for the effect control 
And the second thing is the music. If you want to lower the volume of the background music or add fade in, fade out for the music, you can click here. Music setting. This is the volume, okay, and the fade in and fade out of the music. And you can also click this option to trim the background music if you want. For example, I can just click here and then I have an option to trim the music or select different portion of the background music to use for my video. Okay, for example, I can just select this one and then I can click OK and it will replace this portion of the background music to my video, to the previous one. Okay, just click OK. And the next option is the logo setting. So you want to click here and you can set the duration of the video here. By the way, the maximum duration of the video will depend on how many footage you have in your in the first window. Okay. Just click here at the duration setting, so it's maximum to 30 seconds. But if you have many more footage, then you can set the maximum duration to 10 minutes also. Okay, so for now it is just 30 seconds. And down here is the option for you to change the fonts of the text. For example, you can click this drop down menu and select different fonts for all the titles in the video. Okay, just select here and you can also change the text color also. Just click here and change the text color. For example, I can make it green like this and then you can click OK. Okay, and once you click on any scene in your video, for example, you can click here and you have some effect right here and you can also adjust the effect. For example, if I want to adjust the film look, I can just click this option to edit it and I can reduce the opacity of the effect also. So for example, I can reduce it to this or reset it right here okay so this is the first effect and if you select other other scene in your video then you have different elements and also film file and basic blur effect also you can adjust or delete or hide anything right here with this button okay for example you can also select this element and then you can adjust the scale and position of this element also here so it is easy right so this is the layer attributes and for all the scene here, you can do the same. Down here at the right corner of the preview window, you have the option to change the aspect ratio of the video also. If you want to change it to Instagram or TikTok, you can just select the aspect ratio right here. Okay, okay, and here you also have the render review button. We're similar to the main user interface of Filmora 11. If you want to review your video smoothly, you can hit this button. Okay, so this is for the right side. And on the left side, you have some option to change the title at the opener, at the end credit or lower third, anything to your video. With this option, you can click here at the title tab and then you can select any title right here. For example, I can download this one. I download this title number 30, 38 and then I can add to my video at this scene. Okay, so this is the title. Okay, and I can also select the title here and move it down and then I can also adjust the title here with this option also very nice right I can change the text right here for example I can change Jackie Nguyen and I can also format the title with uh, this option also that is for the title and if you want to replace the background music you have the option right here music but unfortunately we don't have an option to import our own music to the template so hopefully they will add this feature in the future. And now here we have more video template which is similar to the first page. You select here and then you can change the video template that you want to use for your video. Okay, so this is the current video template that you are having on the timeline. And you can select other video template right here. Alright, so that is a quick tour of the editing interface if we use the video template at the startup window. And now if you are happy with this video, you can click this button to export the project. But if you want to have more control of the effect and title, you can click this button timeline to bring everything to the main user interface of Filmora 11. Just edit more, okay? For example, I can click here. And then I can click yes to bring it to Filmora main user interface, okay? Okay, so here is the example project. Very nice, right? And here we can see all the transition. For example, the transition they use and the effect and also 
this is the title and here is a frame number five effect also and if you want to edit or delete the effect right here it is very easy okay all right so that is how to use video template to make a quick video with Filmora 11 i hope this video is helpful for you if you have any more questions just let me know in the comment section below thank you very much for watching and i will see you in the next video goodbye